The iPhone 16 series has only recently hit the market, but Apple is already creating a buzz with leaks about its upcoming iPhone 17 lineup. Among the most exciting rumors is a major design upgrade for the iPhone 17 Pro Max, a smaller dynamic island, possibly enabled by a groundbreaking new technology called MetaLens. Let's break it down. If you've followed Apple's recent innovations, you know the Dynamic Island is a unique display feature that integrates notifications and app interactions into the pill-shaped area around the front-facing camera and Face ID sensors. It's a staple of Apple's current design, but the latest reports suggest it might shrink significantly in the iPhone 17 Pro Max. So, how will Apple achieve this change? According to renowned analyst Jeff Pu, who shared insights in a research note for Haitong International, Apple is exploring MetaLens technology. Unlike traditional glass lenses, metal lenses use nanostructures to focus light. This allows the components to be more compact, without compromising functionality. By swapping out the conventional glass lenses in the Face ID system with metal lens, Apple could reduce the size of the hardware housed in the dynamic island. The result? A smaller notch and potentially more usable screen space for an even more immersive display experience. As of now, this rumored upgrade seems to be exclusive to the iPhone 17 Pro Max, which follows Apple's tradition of debuting advanced features on its high-end models before rolling them out to the rest of the lineup. If this proves true, other models, like the standard iPhone 17 or iPhone 17 Pro, may not see this enhancement immediately. A smaller dynamic island means more display real estate, cleaner design, and a sleeker user experience, all while retaining Apple's industry-leading Face ID security. It's another step forward in Apple's commitment to balancing innovation with practicality. As always, while this rumor is backed by credible sources, it's still early in the iPhone 17 development cycle. Plans could change before the official launch, which isn't expected until September 2025. Are you excited about the possibility of a smaller dynamic island and the use of MetaLens technology? Let us know in the comments below, and stay tuned for more updates as we follow Apple's next big leap.